Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. There is a Japanese king long time ago. Every time he going to do going to the battle, he call all his soldier and then he brought a coin. And he said, "Let we throw this coin." Right? The coin one side is the pictures of the king, the other side just something written. If the picture of king, the one who uh, survives, you know, that means you're going to win. So the king threw it, come out with the picture of the king. And the soldier was so happy. Yes, yes, we can. You will get victory. So therefore, every time before the battle, they throw the coin and ask the picture of king, the picture of the king come out. So they never defeat him. So therefore why the, uh, what you call, Japan able to have, you know, wide and big kingdom. And from the time, you know, nobody, uh, no country, they want to take Japan. Right? So, one day when he, the the king is sick, and his son came, he said, Dad, you know, you are sick, you don't know what's going to happen to you, but please give me that coin that you used to throw it before you go to the battle, so I can follow your step. The first, the king has hesitated, and then said, okay, this is the coin. So the boy took the coin, and look at one side, the picture of, of the king. The other side is the same, the picture of the king. And the boy got angry. Dad, you cheater. You cheat people. I thought you are a hero. You are a cheater. What are you going to say to the people now? Right? And the king said, look, son, I did not manipulate them. I didn't cheat them. Right? What I did is to give them boost spirit. Because when you went to the battle, you have two choice. To win or to win. <laughs> Not to lose. Right? Imagine if 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 I didn't do that. You know, and they come out of what is written. Not the picture of king. The, key, the 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 soldier before they go to battle, they will lose hope, no spirit, begin to lose, right? Uh, so this is what in in our religion they call at the foul. Rasulullah encourage us the Muslim always to be optimism, optimistic. Don't be pessimistic, right? Because that's from Shaitan. Al Yasu is from Shaitan. Lost hope, pessimistic, is from Satan. You know, even with all difficulties, all the challenges, all the trial, Muslim always have to be optimistic. Look at our brother and sister in Gaza. You know, after all this, they still have hope in Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Yeah? So therefore, you know, there is a, what do you call, some attitude, some behavior to show you that you are optimistic. Number one, you have to put a trust that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will help you. Allah what? Will help you. Allah ma'asabirin, Allah ma'almutawakirin. Yeah? Number two, you know, that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will give you what is good for his servant. You know, for his servant who believe and have taqwa in him. Allah promised. وَمَنْ يَتَّقِ اللَّهِ يَجْعَ اللَّهُ مَخْرَجًا He fulfilled Allah, Allah give him way out. Yeah? We have to trust, right, that all the trial, all the calamity, yeah, when they will be gone. It means, you all, you said, in Namal Usri Yisro. For every difficulty, there will be relief. 
long of time ago, there is a, a king, you know, he asked his advisor to write something. Right? He, and then he wrote, he said, this time will go gone. So everything who read it, he'll be happy. If you have difficulties, a problem, a bala, you read it, oh, the bala will go gone one day. If you are good, you are rich, you are strong, you also not be arrogant. You know, they will not be forever. Yeah? So be always optimistic. Allah will love you. Yeah? Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.